Could a curious molecule hiding right underneath our noses be the key to reversing aging? Quercetin, a mysterious antioxidant, has a wide array of benefits that may just be the key to turning back the clock, making us feel younger and live longer. Quercetin has hundreds of studies surrounding it, and new research surfaces every day showing a new incredible benefit. As a result, the scientific community has been hard at work studying all of the amazing effects that it has on the body. But is quercetin all that it's cracked up to be? Well, right now, I'm gonna break down this wide breadth of research so we can better understand just exactly how it can help us. I'll also cover some of the surprising benefits for those of us looking to feel younger and what this could mean for you. And finally, I'll cover the best ways that you can find more quercetin in your diet and how you can best absorb it for maximum effects. What is quercetin? Quercetin is an antioxidant known as a flavanol. It's found in its highest concentration inside dark colored berries like currants and certain vegetables like onions. Quercetin is present in most vegetables and has been widely studied for many years. So where does quercetin get its anti-aging properties from? First, before we talk about what quercetin can do, we have to discuss exactly what causes aging. Aging is a process where our cells are not replenished as quickly as they once were. A large reason for this is the lingering around of old cells that don't get recycled. After enough stress is exerted on these cells over the years, they begin to break down. This means our blood cells clot easier, our skin becomes saggier and less elastic, and our brain cells don't perform as well as they once did. But what if we could combat the cellular aging process head on? That's where a powerful antioxidant like quercetin comes into play. It's been shown in animal studies to fend off molecules that put stress on cells, causing them to age. Not only that, quercetin's antioxidant effect also has been shown in animal studies to stave off neurotoxicity and better preserve brain cells. This can potentially mean a lot of incredible cognitive benefits like a sharper, clearer mind, more focus, and a better memory. Quercetin also appears to have an anti-aging effect through combating inflammation. Even though we may not feel it, inflammation is happening in some form in our bodies right now. Long-term inflammation is highly linked with chronic diseases and poor cell health, which in turn can slow our bodies down. One such chronic disease is arthritis which leaves many of us feeling sharp pains in our joints as we age. Incredibly, quercetin has been shown to be highly correlated with decreased joint inflammation in those with arthritis. These anti-inflammatory effects seem to occur all throughout the body. One study in mice showed a marked full body decrease in inflammation, even when they were being fed an unhealthy, high-fat diet. This remarkable molecule has been shown to be effective in combating one of the biggest markers of early death in humans, cardiovascular disease. In a clinical trial, quercetin has been shown to actually stop blood plasma cells from clotting. As a result, hypertension or high blood pressure was much less of an issue. Amazingly, quercetin appears to naturally lower blood pressure safely, effectively taking unhealthy stress off of our hearts. This led researchers to an interesting hypothesis. If quercetin could lower blood pressure, could it also lower the chances for a stroke? You may have guessed it, a study has indeed shown that it can. Finally, quercetin appears to have a significant effect on breathing in the lungs. In combating inflammation, quercetin has been shown to be able to actually reduce the incidence of asthma. One study showed it was even helpful in curtailing some of the symptoms of seasonal allergies. But if quercetin's already in so many vegetables, why don't we already experience these benefits? It has to do with two problems, presence and bioavailability. Blackberries, Brussels sprouts, broccoli, and onions, and leafy greens are great sources of it, but not always in large amounts. Also, quercetin isn't entirely bioavailable inside the body, and much of it can go undigested without being absorbed. One study, however, found you can dramatically improve quercetin absorption by drinking black or green tea. Studies have also shown quercetin as a supplement is surprisingly bioavailable and can greatly improve levels inside the body. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed today's topic about the anti-aging benefits of quercetin, please like and subscribe to my YouTube channel where I'll be discussing the new and exciting health topics in the field of anti-aging and longevity medicine. I'm Dr. Anil Bajnath, wishing you the best on your journey and becoming a more youthful you. Thank you.